Good morning. You're watching the World Healthcare Congress Interview Zone, and I have with me here today Sangeeta Reddy. She is part of the hospitals, Apollo Hospitals Group based in India, and which runs about 8,500 beds across 50 hospitals in India and overseas. Mm -hmm. Good morning, Sangeeta. Good morning, Mabel. It's a pleasure to be here, and uh, I think that healthcare across the globe is such a critical issue, so it's wonderful to be back learning lessons from colleagues, understanding how the healthcare sector evolves, and seeing how we can relate uh, to some of these challenges and what we can do to help. Um, now, what has really helped the progress of the hospitals over the last few years? Uh, you've started a number of telemedicine initiatives and you're, you've uh, opened up a, a hospital, a brand new, uh, I'm sorry, a, a brand new medical school. Mm -hmm. And so you're training, you're being proactive in finding uh, clinical partnerships? Mm -hmm. So I think that uh, we, we remain true to our mission. And the mission is to find ways to bring advanced healthcare within the reach of people. So this is people of India, people of Asia, people of Africa, as well as international. And the ideology is high quality healthcare uh, with the, the lowest possible costs and a continuous interactive system that keeps people healthy, not just when they're in their hospital, but also find ways to stay connected with them. That's the new dimension of healthcare that we're looking at. Absolutely. Um, How many people do you believe, what percentage of people in India are still have little access to healthcare? So about 30% of people have very have difficulty accessing healthcare, but the good news is that uh, solutions like telemedicine have evolved tremendously. Uh, Twelve years ago when President Bill Clinton inaugurated our first telemedicine solution, we were on a VSAT model. We moved to the internet and now with mobile phone, uh, rural healthcare workers have access to advanced second opinion services at the touch of a phone mm -hmm. button. Absolutely. So uh, technology is transforming the way we look at healthcare. Empowerment of people is uh, increasing the way they, they demand healthcare and changing the way they access healthcare. And Apollo intends to assist in the appropriate revolution of, of really you know, transforming healthcare through IT. This mm -hmm. is something we, we believe in, we've worked a lot in and uh, we're seeing it really come alive. So on one end, we continue to build advanced high technology hospitals. We have become the largest liver transplant program in the world. How did that so happen? So I think it was a matter of focus, of uh, bringing that high quality to people, of clinical partnerships and learning with some of the best centers uh, in the United States, and then taking these lessons home and scaling just consistent pursuit of scale and quality and um, and focus on high outcomes with lowering costs. All right, Sangeeta, that's exciting. We look mm -hmm. forward to getting an update again at our mm -hmm. next meeting. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Thank you. And I'm Mabel Jong. Thanks for watching. Thank you.